All right, it's time to get you and your entire family hooked on science with my third favorite meteorologist in the world, <laughs> Jason Lindsay. <laughs> well, thank you. How kind of you, well, Mr. Well, Caldwell. Who's number one? Me. Yeah, of course. Chris Bailey has to be number two. Of course. He doesn't have to be. Well, he's the <laughs> boss, so he's got to be number okay. two. Well, my second favorite host. <laughs> oh, oh, I see how this is I'm going. I'm joking. I love you equally. So, cool science today, as always. How's life been? Good? Yes, You've absolutely. You've been doing lots yeah. of science? Yeah. Well, you know, Every single day is a science challenge. Of course. Well, you're in the weather business. <laughs> That's you know right. That. So I have a few ingredients up here. We're going to make a baby bottle explode. But we're going to start with one that has to do with an orange and a lemon. What are you doing over there? I'm doing all the electronics. I have overinflated a balloon there. You're going to be responsible for the orange and that one. Okay. And my friend here, India, is going to be responsible for this one and the balloon I'm going to blow up here. <laughs> this has to do with matter, anything that takes up space and has mass. <laughs> And we're going to pop a balloon with both of these, but they can't touch, by the way. What can't touch? The balloon to the orange or the lemon. Oh, okay. All right. Now, we've done a lim an orange before, but did you know a lemon will work as well? I, I did not It has know that. to do with what's in the peeling. <laughs> And making sure you have an overinflated balloon. If I pass out over here, just keep going. I love that. You just keep talking about it. Just blow up the balloon. That's what makes me happy. Okay, there we go. Right. So, would you like for me to start this out, or do you want to do it? I, I want. I want to go right. So balloons out. are made up of small pieces. We're going to unglue those small pieces by using the oil in the peeling of the. Oh! Oh, gravy. <laughs> no, no, no. A piece no. Of shot over no, there. Did. Right, Jason? No. Is that what happened? Yes, it no. did. No, no, no. So, I'm sorry, India. Are no. you okay? Are you safe? No. No. She said it's that scared me with Jim and Jason. so bad. <laughs> okay, scoot back because we're going to do this one again. Oh. So, the lemon works, obviously, right? Yeah, yeah the So, lemon let's works. do the orange one. We're going to squeeze the oil on there. And yes, this is almost instantly. You probably didn't know the power behind an orange and a lemon. It's the oil in the peeling that takes apart the smaller pieces that make up the balloon. Okay, wow, that one was a little shocker for a that second there. I loved it. So we've done loved this one it. before too, but we're going to move from this to this. I have an Alka-Seltzer. We've added water in here before. We create a chemical reaction and it kind of explodes. We're creating a gas on the inside. Do you ever get gassy? Yes. Yes, he does a lot. Every day. We'll snap this on. This is a film canister. We're going to add some water on the inside. A gas is going to build up. We're going to create this same reaction inside of a baby bottle. Oh, it's moving. Wow. I think the studio is haunted. Well, yeah, that's yeah. exactly what I said. Why did you so, put me in front of you? Uh, She's like, you are my spills. shield. You I are my shield. I just want you to oh, be wow. the one to get it first. Yeah. Oh, wow. And there it goes. And there it goes. What happens if we do that in the baby bottle? Uh, the nipple will fly out. You think it'll fly out? I think so. And yeah. It'll catch really one big. of you on fire and yeah. expand because of what, Jim? Because of a chemical reaction creating a new gas called carbon dioxide. dioxide. Look at that game, <laughs> fine. <laughs> That's okay, I'm done weather. here. I I, I've done my job. I, I've taught you. You've taught yourselves. Okay, so what you're going to do is you're going to drop these in there. Do we have time for this one? Yeah, sure. Uh, yeah. Jim, Jim's going to drop them in. Drop Why am I doing it? Again, uh, don't want to get wet. Drop it in. Drop Both? It in. Both, yes. Ooh. Drop this you one in. You used Alka-Seltzer brand. Did. You didn't use the off brand either. I, I did not. That You know, fancy. Yeah, fancy. So you just keep mixing that up. Just yeah. Do you I need to ahead. shake it or just hold it? Just gently mix it. What do you mean <laughs> by gently mix it, Jason? Like mix it, mix it. You like how both of us got out of frame. Well, like this, just back and yeah, right. there. Yeah, just go ahead. Go. All right. Yep. So you'll notice a gas is starting to build up. You can look at the container and notice something is happening on the inside. Right. You can speed that up and see how the rubber. Part, oh, oh, there it goes. Oh, oh, there it goes. Just, just keep shaking it back and forth. Shaking, We're shaking. creating that gas. Shake. Well, just do it like that. Oh, there you want go. me to do the big ones? <laughs> yes. Okay. You'll notice the gas is building up. The rubber part is expanding. See is it going to blow? See the rubber. Will part? it blow? I don't know. How much gas can it take. So this baby bottle, the rubber part, does not have a hole in it. And there it goes. What? Yes, it did explode. Where'd it go? I don't know. <sighs> I always like to leave science here in the studio. Jason, why do you later. always blow things up when there you come? There was a lot of explosions today, wasn't there? Alka-Seltzer's launching through the air, or at least canisters. We had a baby bottle explode. Did you see where it went? No, I'm still looking for it. Yeah. You know, the, the thing is, Jason, six months from now, we'll find that. Yeah, we or will. He'll be at the anchor desk and it'll fall from the ceiling. Or then there's <laughs> That, which would make for that would be great TV. Right there. You, you know, got, lots of fun stuff. You've always got fun stuff, and you're always doing fun things. You're touring the country. Mm -hmm. That's what you do. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, for.
for those people that remember Jason, he was on here with us doing weather, and that's been you know that was the first thing that got you into the TV was was doing weather. Right? Actually, I used to be scared of storms. Right. I was okay. a kid, five years old, crawling, hiding under beds because of lightning and closets, and because of that scaredness. What was ironic is. I would go learn more about weather, weather, read books, do science experiments, developed a love for weather, became a meteorologist, and now travel America, the world, getting kids excited about science. How far have uh, you been in this? Oh, Honduras, Brazil, really? um, where else? I've been to uh, Germany. When I was in Honduras, the kids called me Senor Ciencia. Senor, uh, Mr. Science. Ciencia Science, so Mr. Science is how I got the nickname back in 2010, thanks to those So that's how that happened, kids. that's where you yes. got that. Yeah, what? I didn't make it up, it was, you know, came from the kids. I would go into their little communities and I would come back the next day and they're like, Senor Ciencia, Senor Ciencia, as we would pop balloons with oranges and lemons and so on. It's summertime, kids are getting out of school, you can get a slew of these experiments that are safe, ones that won't blow your kid up, at hookedonscience.org. Hooked on Perfect. Mm -hmm. and, and, and people, like educators out there, can, mm -hmm. can they reach out to you on the website? Oh, too? they can if they go to hookedonscience.org and click on contact us and they'll be able to exactly do that. Connect with me, come to your school, already booking for next year, right. already about 50% booked for the new school year. It's not even here yet. So yeah. make sure you get on there and you get an experience for your students that is unforgettable. Oh, am I on time? No, no, today's no. the okay. ninth. I was just looking at my watch. I was like, today's the ninth day of May. I mean, school's almost out. So yes. yeah, next year. So we're talking about year. August yeah. all the way into next May. We're starting uh, to book up and do cool science experiments with kids and making sure it's an unforgettable experience. What was your favorite one today? Do you have a favorite one? Uh, no, because they all pop. <laughs> and everything <laughs> scares me. Everything scares me. You know, we're going to have to set the set on fire again. Let's remember that. I got in trouble last time. I know. Yeah. Fire yeah. extinguisher. We did. They we specifically did. put that fire extinguisher under this desk because of you. Uh, and it was because of Jason. I know. Oh, no. Nope. No nope. quotes. It's so good to see you. <laughs> it's it okay. Was. It no was. Okay, break the quote. You yeah. always do <laughs> and ask for forgiveness later. That's exactly. <laughs> That's what I've always told. <laughs>